that the denominators are very easy to find, we can see that the LCD will just be x plus 3 and x minus 2. Now that means, oh, then from there we can quickly get our restriction. And so we can find that x cannot be minus 3 and x cannot be equal to 2. Okay, so now let me just rewrite everything. So we're going to have to multiply this one with x minus 2 this one with x plus 3, and this one with both. Okay, so there we've done that. Now that the denominators are the same, we can cancel them. And so now we can multiply, well, no, we don't. Now we just write everything down. Okay, now you multiply everything in. So x squared minus 2x plus 7x plus 21. Now here's where there's three things. So you leave the 3 on the outside, and you multiply the two brackets together. So it's x squared minus 2x plus 3x minus 6. And so I'm just going to simplify a little bit here on the left-hand side. Then I'm going to multiply this in. All right, then I'm going to take everything to the right-hand side. See, I just put those two together. You can do this in a different way to me. It's as long as you get to the same answer at the end. Okay. Then I'm going to put the x squares together, so that's going to give us 2x squared. Then I'm going to put the x's together, which will be minus 2x, and then minus 39. And so our first answer is x equals to 4.94, or x is going to be equal to negative 3.94.